Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Depending on the time and location you are tuned in to this uh, UAG Grand Disbursement uh, update. Today is Tuesday and uh, a lot of things are going on now, which will give you the feedback uh, later. Mm, you know one thing, uh, some of the beneficiaries and the masses and some of them that are close to this UAG, as in Ken and his people, some understand it and some don't understand it. They use some of people that are close to them and the beneficiaries as a distractor. They put two people together to fight so that everybody will be focusing on their fight. Then they will be doing what they are doing. That shifts attention from what is on ground. What is on ground is that we need this husband to want this money. But they will put two heads together, two friends together their heads together, two brothers together, knock their head. When they are now quarreling, the message will be carrying is their quarrel, not the money. Because they know if we unite together and follow one cause and move as brothers and sisters, this money will come out. So they put people on loggerheads. They don't come out to, to make peace. To When there's a conflict, they don't come out to debunk one side so that they will know, people will say, this is the truth. They leave it. They will quarrel them. So listen to this voice note, another battle for this movement. Listen to this voice note. We'll see you at the other end. Good afternoon, everybody. In this grant community ecosystem. I'd agree to everybody. My speak grammar. I might speak uh, pigeon. Okay. I got a mix up because the person I want to talk to is no other person but uh, Mr. Taye Tom Way Muhammad. Today is first day of April in this beautiful year of our Lord 2024. Uh, tire is like uh, you just want to talk. It's like sometimes you feel not to be heard any longer. You all, always want your voice to be heard. And uh, when you feel that people no longer listen or recognize your voice, you then begin to talk. I can just tell you that your voice note this afternoon is just very useless. Because I held myself to listen to you from the beginning towards the end of it. I couldn't finish listening to that voice note because I'm almost at the end of it. But I couldn't comprehend anything. I couldn't understand anything. You were just ranting like a mad dog. You did not say anything reasonable to my hearing. You only came out to cause trouble, to call people names, to call Apostle Ken name, names, and insult him and insult Obima, we insult uh, Elder Josiah, uh, Elder Hakim, Shola Josiah, insult um, elders, uh, other elders in the grant community, which is very bad. Uh, even if you are born not to love peace. I think your religion is a religion of peace. Though many of them, many people, many young men there have been deceived to take the other side of life. I mean the life, the side of uh, violence but uh, even if you don't love peace I think people 
in this grant community love peace and uh, i just want to make a short voice note and thereby i want to just advise you to desist from that uh, uh, frivolous and that useless attitude of yours i know after I, after i'm done now you will come but when you come again then i'll be ready i'll be very i will give it to you hot anyhow you want it I'll give it to you in any form, in any way you might come. Just get ready to take it. And therefore, what I'm saying is that what you are doing is not good. Stop it. Stop calling people names. Stop insulting Apostle Ken. Let me say this to you, and I want you to bear it in your mind. If you have subscribed for UAAG grant, and uh, at the end of the day, by the mercies of God, and God uses both our dear comrades, the president of our Grand Pleasure Group, Comrade Abdul Yakub and uh, his team in conjunction with Apostle Ken, if God uses them to disperse grant and you happen to take even one naira out of that money to eat, if you receive it into your account and take one naira out of it to eat, or to do anything that will benefit you and your household. From that moment, you will be under course. You will never eat that money well. That money will never enter your soul, your spirit, and your body well. It will be a cause. It will be a source of sorrow to you. You know why? Because whatever you sow, you will reap. You said, uh, 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 UAAG has no money. But yet, the platform through which you will receive the money is also UAAG platform. Comrade uh, Ostas Daoud has made it known, time without number, that AGPGN has no grant. They are not grant handlers. And as we all know, that the money they are overseeing, the disbursement at the moment, does not belong to them. It belongs to someone else. But by privilege of God, they came in contact with it and uh, it was entrusted to them to carry out the disbursement in conjunction with Apostle Ken. And therefore, everything you have said insulting these elders, these people, because of who you think you, you are. Mr. Man, you will reap it. And uh, if you take one night out of it to benefit your life, it will become sorrow to you. Go and write it down. As I have spoken, so shall it be. You can never change it. And therefore, let us learn. I'm talking to grand community right now. Let every one of us learn how to maintain peace. Peace is better than violence anywhere in the world. Although we are coming close to the end of the age, but that is not a yardstick for anyone to justify violence and justify evil. 
looking for trouble where there is no trouble. Trying to make trouble when provoked and when not provoked. Therefore, even if any other people or age are to make trouble, I want to let us know that Nigeria does not need trouble at the moment. Nigeria, as we know, is very fragile. Any useless noise anybody will make might not end only in grant community. It might generate to something else in our nation. So we need peace. No matter what, we need peace. We need peace to move forward as a nation and to see what God has for us. And therefore, you are coming out to insult everybody and to use style insult Igbo people. Uh, who told you that Igbos have classes of people? We are not like your people. Are you hearing me? And let me tell you, any Igbo man, you, tire. Any Igbo man you insult is better than you, than you are, and that you ever can imagine to be 100 times. So whether you insult Ken or you insult some certain people, that one does not change that fact. And let me tell you some other Igbo people, you people have been able to cow their mindset to your, that of your type. Those ones are, we call them Ifleif. Ifleif. So, there are people like that in every race, in every tribe. And so, I just want to let you know that your voice you note this afternoon does not make any sense or any meaning to anybody. It doesn't matter what you tag it, what you tag it rather, so that when people see it, they will think that you have spoken. And because we have been making voice notes and uh, people have been listening to you. Recently, all the voice notes you are making are useless. And let me, let me tell you, have you not discovered that? Or let me ask you a question, you Taya. Which of the voice notes you have ever made in the grant community that people have stood upon, just like any time Jennifer Isaac, any time Obinwabo, any time Ostas Daoud, any time Abdul, any time uh, Usim, all these ones that have made name, all these people that have made name in this ecosystem, any time they talk, People stand on what they say to, it, to react either negatively or positively. Since we are making voice note in this grant community ecosystem, Taye, have anybody, whether sensible or not, or not, have anybody, has anybody reacted to your voice note, to anything you said? in your voice note, either negatively or positively. Have anybody, has it, has it ever happened? That is for you to know that you are useless in the grant community. And uh, the recent voice notes you have made so far, 
to this last one you made today. This today, 1st of April. They are all useless. And uh, bunch, and they are all bunch of ways of making noise. Therefore, I advise you shut your mouth and keep quiet. We are all expecting disbursement. And for the fact that you have said that no disbursement is coming from UAAG, as far as the disbursement is released and uh, whether through Apostle Ken of UAAG or Abdul and his team or from anybody and your name happens to be there because I'm sure you did not submit any data to Abdul or AGPGM but you happen to receive any grant there from it Mr. Man, it will be useless to you unless you come out to say I am sorry that you are sorry to all these people you have insulted. Otherwise, watch out, you will see it come to reality. I greet everybody in the Grand Community today. May God bless all of you. And I pray that God will not let us to continue to wait in this system and in this community. I pray that this month and this week shall be our week of joy and favor and blessing and the week and the month of manifestation of our highly awaited miracle so be it may god bless all of you i am mr ab well done so my people you have seen what i'm saying this person attacking this person, this person fighting this person, this person antagonizing this person. My brothers, my sisters, that's not what we need now. We need to come together and move for one cause for this bosmate. See you at the other side.